Hey there lads and ladies, it is Petrifying Pumpkins here and today I want to talk all about the game that's playing behind me right here. Bullet Roulette. I don't know if you've ever heard about this game. This game is over on the PC viewer. Basically it's a Russian roulette game, social experience, as you can see playing in the background. Russian roulette, not that hard to figure out. I've always wanted this game to come to PS viewer because I thought it looked pretty cool. It could be like a werewolves within social game type thing, if you know what I'm saying. So about two months ago, I went on over to Reddit here, and I met this post right here, where I said, you know, any word on a PSVR release for Bullet Roulette VR. This is two months ago. I had people replying saying, is there an actual game here? You know, uh, so you don't know what the point of this game is and all this kind of, you know, I just hate Redis. I hate Redis, I hate people. But 12 hours ago, which is now probably one day ago, it is one day ago, I had this guy here, Fibram, saying, working on us. So if we go to Fibram, we check his page. Fibram is actually a virtual reality developer who worked on this game. All this bullet roulette stuff. So I've looked into them, Fibram's legit. This game is confirmed now to be coming to PSVR, or at least they're working on us. I know nothing is 100% confirmed. Things can change at any time, but that's as good as confirmation as you're gonna guess. I've looked around, I don't see them confirming this anywhere else. So this is kind of a hot scoop. We talked about it a little bit last night in Touch and Tips podcast, but I just wanted to make an official separate video that can go viral and I can get a lot of views and then, you know, cash in on these breaking news thing stories, you know? Anyway, that's all I kind of wanted to say. I just wanted to get that news out there. And now that it is, there's no really, there's no real other news I have. I don't have a release date. So I don't have a price point. I don't have anything like that. So we just got to wait and see. Fingers crossed, won't be too far away. The game itself doesn't, not to disrespect the game, doesn't look too complex in terms of like, you know, porting this over to PSVR. Uh, it's not, doesn't look like it's too straining on a system. I hope. So fingers crossed, that means, you know, not too long of a port time. And that's it for this video. So before I end this video, I'd like to thank my Patreon supporters whose names are on the screen right now. Thanks to their generosity, they're helping keep this channel going. And in particular, I'd like to mention the following Columbus Thomas III, Crum, Pete Hawkins, and Tradition. It's four, but I can't do that. There we go. Who are supporting me on the top tier over on Patreon. So thank you very much for your generosity, lads. I do appreciate that very much. Finally, check out Decepticon.com for the music in this video. He's, you can get his music for free over on bandcamp.com. His music is going to be featured in the upcoming Alvo now, which is officially... You're allowed to talk about that now, so that's official. So look forward to that if you're looking forward to Alvo. And finally, if you want to drop a like or a share or subscribe or anything like that in this video, I'd appreciate that too. I'm going to end the video right there, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.